Have you been looking for a way to build an email list in order to grow your audience online? If yes, then you are in the right place. In this video, you will learn how to build an email list for free using an all-in-one marketing tool called System.io. I welcome you all to Epson Metrics. My name is Adibayo Joseph. If this is your first time of watching my channel, please, I urge you to support my channel simply by subscribing to this channel. Like this video and don't forget to share it among your friends so that this time I drop out some content like this, you'll be the first person to find out. Now, let's dive in straight away into today's video. So, all you need to do is to go to system.io. You can check the link in the description below so that you can sign up for free using my affiliate link and you are going to be on the same page so that you can easily follow along with me. Now, all you need to do is to enter your email here so now i'm going to enter my email i'm done entering my email so i'm going to click on get my free accounts so um, i'm going to wait for it to load after it's downloading you'll be asked to confirm your email address just go to your email box and check the email sent to you once i don't confirm your email address you'll be able to be on the dashboard so let me confirm the email and meet you on the next section so you also do your own confirm your email so that you can be on the same page now this is how your dashboard is going to look like can you see this dashboard is fresh you don't have any lead yet so you can see this is how everything is going to look like so let me quickly run you through some of the interface so this on that dashboard you want to check your affiliate dashboard this is where you are going to see it this is where you are going to find the marketplace. This is for the contacts and the tags. Now, this the contacts you have on your system accounts based on the number of emails, email lists you have generated. Then we have funnel. If you want to build funnel, you have email, newsletter, campaign, statistics. If you want to build a blog, automation like rules and workflows, and so on and so forth. But let's dive in straight into today's business. All you need to do to build an email list is to click on funnels. So once you click on funnels, it's going to load. So you'll be able to set up a new funnel for yourself, whereby you'll be able to collect email directly. So now, after it's downloading, I'm going to click on create to create a new funnel. So you can name this funnel anything you like. For instance, you can name it the name of your lead magnet or anything so it all depends on you this ebook that i want to give out for free as a lead magnet is called affiliate cash machine so i'm going to name it the name of the lead magnet so if you don't know what a lead magnet is a lead magnet is something free something tangible that you can easily give out for free in exchange for the email that people is going to give to you. So, however, a lead magnet could be anything. It don't have to be an ebook alone. It can be anything you can think of. But it should be something tangible. That is something that will solve people's problem. Something of high value. So now let's move on. So after you are done entering the name, I'm going to click on build an audience. So once you click on build an audience, you click on, you click on save. Then don't worry about this currency since we are not selling anything yet. So now, after you are done, you are going to click on it. This is it. This is the funnel we have just named. So click on affiliate cash machine, just like we name it. So it's going to load. So we have pre made templates that you can easily customize. One thing I like about system.io is that it's a drag and drop builder. What you see is what you get. Basically, you don't have to worry about anything. Even if you don't have prior design experience, this is very, 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 very easy to use. So you can customize it. Just drag it and drop it anywhere you like. Pick any any of the templates and you will be good to go. So we have all these pre-made templates that you can easily customize to your taste. So that is it. So now. Let me look on any of the templates that I can easily customize and make use of. Now, let me see which one will work better for this thing we wanted to. 
Okay, because we want to give out an ebook as a lead magnet. Now, I'm going to click on this one. I'm going to click on this one. And you can preview on any one of them before you actually click on it. You can preview on any one. But this one will work better for what I want to use it for. So I'm going to click on this one. So can, you are free to choose any one you like based on all these templates. And you can also preview before you choose any one of them. It's not loading. So as you can see, we have squeeze page and we have thank you page. And you can also add some step. As if you want to create a sales funnel and some other things, you can click on add step. But I'm not going to be doing that because basically you only really want to collect emails. You want to give out a lead magnet to have the people's email. So here I'm going to click on the squeeze page. Since I'm here, then I'm going to click on this pen icon to edit page. So click on the pen icon so that you'll be able to edit the page. So this is how the template looks like. This is how it looks like. So you can easily customize the template and make it your own. Very simple. Now let me quickly explain all these tools for you. So now, based on these two on your left hand side, this is where you are going to be getting all the tools that you wanted to use to basically build anything any one of them that you want to use you only need to drag it can you see magnet that i wanted to give based on the free ebook in exchange for the people's email now i'm going to click on the image just click on the image once you click on the image then you are going to see this upload icon click on this upload icon so that you'll be able to upload the image from your computer then select click on select once you click on select, you'll be able to upload the image from your computer. So, I'm going to select it from my desktop. So I'm going to select it under my document because I have it saved there. So I'm going to click on e cover. So once I click on e cover, so you have any one that you can easily select. You have small, you have medium, and you have this one. So I'm going to choose this one. So I'm going to click on open. So once you click on open, it will be able to upload and you'll be able to make use of it in your design. So it's currently uploading. Now it's done uploading. All you need to do is to click on insert. So insert, once you insert it, it will be here. Can you see? So it has been inserted. All you need to do is to click on the image. Once you click on the image, click on it, then you'll be able to come to this left hand side. You are going to see image size. Then you can you can increase the image size up to let me say something like 350. Or you can easily type it. You can type it here. Let me type it like 350. So it's looking good currently. So this is the ebook image. So now I'm going here. Yeah, I'm going to write something like this. This is what I've written. Do you want to stay on top of your athlete marketing game? This is a question, though. So once I'm done entering, because well, as it is, it's not looking good right now. So I'm going to reduce the font size. All you need to do is to come to this font size and reduce the font size. So I'm going to reduce the font size to something like 30. So then likewise, I'm going to reduce the font, the line height, the line height to 40 as well. I can easily change the color. Now this, if I like, I can change the color, but I can also leave it this way. So now I'm going to highlight this section this athlete marketing game so i'm going to highlight it then i'm going to give it another color so i'm going to give it a red color it has been duplicated so i'm going to write something like this you need you need athlete cash machine cash machine So can you see? You need athlete cash machine. So I'm going to increase the font size of this one. So I'm going to make it bold. 
So it's bold already. So I'm going to increase the font size of this one. I'm going to increase the font size. I'm going to increase the font size. So well, as you can see, it's not looking good. Likewise, I'm going to increase the line height. So let me increase the font size more. So I will increase the line height. Now, the font size is looking good anyway. Can you see the space in between here is too much? So now let's decrease the margin. All you need to do is to click on this icon, decrease it. So let's decrease the, part, the margin. The margin is too much. Can you see? It's now going up. So it's good this way. Let's, let's remove it totally. Yes, it's looking good this way. Can you see? So the margin is no more there. So the margin is not there anymore. So here we are going to change this color to the color of this section here. And so I'm going to pick this color. So you are going to pick a color on this page using a color picker. So I have this color picker that I am using. So the color has been picked. So I'm going to paste the color here. Can you see? So I'm going to paste the color here. So can you see the color has changed to the color of this section here. So it's now looking good this way. Can you see? So then enter your name and email to access all the resources for free. So I'm going to change it to get access for free. To get access for free. So it's looking good this way. It's looking good. So once people enter their first name and email address, they will be able to get it. So now I'm going to copy this color code. Let me copy this color code so that I can use it for the button as well. Let me copy the color code. Can you see? Copy. Can you see how this button is looking like right now? So click on the button. Then once you click on the button, the property will show here on the left hand side. So I'm going to paste the color code here. Now we have the red color for the button. So we are done with the button right now. So based on this button, so I'm going to change the button text. To change the button text, click on the button as well. Then you are going to scroll down. So you are going to see button text. You can then change it to give me access now. Give me me access now so can you see or oh, give me access give me access is looking good is okay give me access is okay give me access so once i'm done entering give me access so then action when button is clicked so i'm going to change it to next step URL. Change it to next step URL. So that once they click on this, give me access, it will redirect them to the next step where they can be able to download the ebook after submitting their email. So click on save changes. Once you click on save changes, then you'll be able to exit. Once you click on exit, you move on to the next section, which is thank you page. Also, here you have various templates you can customize. So you have a lot of templates. So I'm going to select a simple thank you page. I'm going to select this thank you page. Then, so after then, I'm going to click on edit page. So I can easily edit the page. Now, this is how the page looks like. So, but basically, I don't need any of this section. So, I'm going to delete the whole section here. I'm going to delete everything. No, I'm going to leave this button. Then, maybe I can need this one also. Now, let me delete this one. Then, I'm going to delete this one. So, 
I'm going to delete this one also. I'm done. Click below to download your free ebook. Then, once I'm done, I'm now going to change it to this button text. I'm going to change the button text to download now. So, this button text will be changed to download now. Instead of click here to join our community for free, I'm going to change download. Download now. So now, basically, I'm done right now. I'm done. So then, this particular button, what will happen when the button is clicked? Action, when button is clicked, then I'm going to change it to download file so that I can easily upload the ebook directly here on my system dashboard. So I'm going to click on this upload icon, then I'm going to click on select file. So I have it under my document, so I'm going to select the PDF here, select Athlet Cash Machine, click on Open. So once you click on Open, it will be able to upload. So once it's done uploading, you are going to click on Insert File. Can you see? I'm going to insert it now. So now, is here currently that we inserted. Then I'm going to click on Save Changes. Then I'm going to Exit. So click on this icon to exit. This is the ebook. So this is the ebook, so they can click on download, they can print it and do it anyhow they like. This ebook is gotten from freeplrdownload.com. This is a place where you can download free ebook and use it as a lead magnet. So if you need to download your own, you can go to freeplrdownload.com to get your ebook there for free using system.io. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like this video share this video and don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that each time i drop awesome content like this you'll be the first person to find out thank you so much see you all in my next video please if you have any questions regarding this video let me know in the comment section below and i'll